Well, the story behind this video is simple. I was on my way to work, and there's only two ways to get from the town I live in to the town that I was working in. And it's a small, uh, both of them are small two-lane roads, uh, very tight, tons of traffic. So I'm going through there at rush hour. Uh, you know, the sun's going down, as you can see in the video, and the sun's in my face. That's the other thing about it. Uh, so I'm just driving like I normally would be. And then I see this thing out of the corner of my eye, and I thought it was like a reflection off of my windshield. As it turns out, it was nothing like that at all. So I see this thing, and like I said, I think it's something from my windshield, but then I'm like, okay, well, it's not. And then I'm like, is this a, some kind of cloud or something? But it wasn't making any sense. And plus, I'm trying to dodge traffic and the sun. So I reach around. I find my phone. I need to mention that my phone is incredibly cheap. Like, I don't, I'm don't. i not spending a lot of money on the phone, and, I don't, and it doesn't matter to me. So I have like this $35, $45 Walmart phone, you know, and this was like six years ago, basically, when this happened. So, you know, the camera quality is terrible as it is. And the reason it's so shaky and violent looking is because I'm holding the phone, being blinded by the sun, trying to drive and not get killed by oncoming traffic. You know, I mean, like I said, incredibly narrow road, tons of traffic speeding, insane. So, and plus I'm trying to like keep this thing in the camera view, you know, at the same time. It was really tricky. And um, anyway, and, I, and there's no audio because I cut the audio out. The only thing you're going to hear is my radio and me cussing because I did cuss a few times because I nearly died and it was just like, I don't know, it was a lot. So, <laughs> so from there, I basically uh, got what I had on my phone, got to work. I showed it to people at work uh, and nobody was really interested in it. It was just kind of like nonchalant, like, oh, yeah, that's cool. I mean, one person was literally like on their phone doing something, looked and said, oh, yeah, that's pretty neat. And then went right back to their phone like they like I'm like, you know, you don't understand what you just saw, man. Like, I don't understand what I just saw. I don't even know what this is. And then, so then I just put it on up on Facebook. I mean, on Facebook. Edit. So then I just put it up on YouTube and just kind of waited to see if anybody would, I don't know, help me figure out what it was I saw. And the thing was, I never heard any reports about it. I looked around on like for anything, like the news locally, you know, couldn't see anything. I never, I don't know. So to this day, I just, I don't know. It was just there, and then I, my life went on, and I, I forgot about it, you know. And then I, I just found it again, basically, and was like, oh yeah, this thing. So yeah, if anybody knows, uh, let me know. So there you go. My, it's my best friend, Jimmy T. I've known him all my life. Why he's just not telling me he's got a damn video of UFOs, I don't know. But <laughs> it's real because he's real. You tell me.